NASA's Voyager 1 spacecraft is a true pioneer in space exploration. It holds the title of the most distant human-made object in space. After more than 45 years, Voyager 1 has successfully crossed into interstellar space, marking a historic milestone that reshapes our understanding of the universe. Imagine launching a spacecraft decades ago, and it's still exploring regions far beyond expectations. This is the reality of NASA's Voyager mission, which continues to defy the limits of space exploration. Despite being launched in 1977, this spacecraft still sends valuable data back to Earth using technology that is older than a cassette player. It's remarkable that Voyager 1 still functions despite its age, a true testament to the durability of its design. Voyager 1 recently made a discovery that stunned the world and left scientists in awe. As it travels deeper into space, it uncovers new information about uncharted regions, challenging everything we thought we knew about the cosmos. These discoveries are reshaping our understanding of the universe, adding to the growing body of knowledge about space. The incredible journey of Voyager 1 started during a time when two major space missions revolutionized space travel. Thanks to Gary Flandro at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory, a route was mapped that included Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. This optimal path was discovered using just a pencil and basic tools, and it created a gravitational shortcut for space travel. This method, known as gravity assist, allowed the spacecraft to gain speed by using a planet's gravitational pull. This once-in-a-lifetime alignment of planets only occurs once every 176 years, reducing a 30-year journey to just 12 years. Recognizing this rare opportunity, NASA launched Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 just 15 days apart in 1977. Little did NASA know that these twin probes would continue sending valuable data for more than 45 years, far beyond the original mission's expected lifespan. In their early years, both spacecraft captured breathtaking images of Jupiter and Saturn's moons. These images revealed volcanoes and ice fields, offering insights into these distant worlds. Voyager 2 later became the first spacecraft to reach Uranus in 1986 and Neptune in 1989, providing invaluable scientific data. Despite being about the size of a Volkswagen Beetle, these spacecraft defied all odds. They even used a slingshot maneuver around Venus to gain momentum toward Mercury. Their journey through space was filled with challenges, including passing through dangerous asteroid belts and covering distances that are ten times the distance between Mercury and Earth. These probes were equipped with just 69 kilobytes of memory, far less than today's smartphones. Despite the limited memory and basic technology, the spacecraft managed to navigate space and store data. Data was initially stored on tape before being transmitted back to Earth using a 23-watt transmitter, which is about the same power as a standard light bulb. As Voyager 1 and 2 traveled further into space, the time it took for their signals to reach Earth drastically increased. Today, it takes more than 18 hours for a signal from Voyager 2 to arrive on Earth. Background noise from modern electronics also makes reception more difficult. Despite these challenges, the spacecraft continued to send groundbreaking discoveries, offering a deeper understanding of the vast universe beyond our solar system. One of the most intriguing contributions involves the Oort cloud, a distant region filled with comet-like objects that are bound by the sun's gravity. The spacecraft are slowly approaching this mysterious zone, yet their journey took a huge step when they crossed the heliopause. This boundary separates the sun's influence from the vast expanse of interstellar space. When Voyager 1 crossed this boundary on August 25, 2012, it detected an increase in plasma density, but surprisingly, the magnetic field remained largely unchanged. This unexpected discovery shocked scientists as they had predicted a dramatic shift in the magnetic field beyond the heliosphere. Instead, the data suggested that the sun's magnetic influence extends further than previously believed. As a result, the data sent by both Voyager 1 and 2 has challenged scientific theories about the edge of our solar system and the nature of space beyond. The mission, originally expected to last only a few years, has revolutionized our knowledge of the universe. It has also shown us that exploration often defies expectations, and technology from the 1970s continues to push the boundaries of what we know. The Voyager missions have done more than expand our knowledge of space, 
they've inspired generations of scientists, engineers, and space enthusiasts. Their continued success highlights human ingenuity and our relentless pursuit of the unknown. Every piece of data these spacecraft transmit adds to our understanding of the cosmos. As we look toward the future, the legacy of the Voyager spacecraft will continue to shape upcoming space missions. Scientists are using Voyager's discoveries to explore topics like dark matter, dark energy, and the potential for extraterrestrial life. The technology developed for Voyager paved the way for modern space missions, with advancements in communication, navigation, and data collection stemming from the challenges faced by these missions. The Voyager missions remind us of the boundless possibilities of exploration and discovery. Their incredible journey serves as a testament to human curiosity and perseverance. These spacecraft have ventured farther than anyone ever imagined, delivering invaluable insights about our solar system and beyond. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.